Shalom Shalit announced on Monday that he intends to run for a place on the Israel Labor Party list for the next Knesset. Noam Shalit, who has been a member of the Israel Labor Party since 1996, informed Israel Labor Party chairperson Shelly Yechamovich of the decision. Yechamovich congratulated Shalit and said that the battle of Noam Shalit and his family to free Gilad started as a private battle but turned into a battle that contained within it all the base values of Israeli society, solidarity, mutual support, and Zionism. Veteran Israeli journalist Yair Lapid announced that he was leaving his longtime news anchor position at Channel 2 in order to compete in the next Israeli elections. It is unclear at this point which political party Lapid will seek to run under, although it is believed he will seek to run under a newly established independent party. Opposition leader Tzipi Livni welcomed Lapid's decision, saying that more people should join politics in order to make positive change in Israel. Several recent surveys forecasted that a Lapid-led party could garner between 15 and 20 mandates in the Knesset. MK Anastasia Michaeli is facing an ethics complaint after pouring a cup of water on MK Ghalab Majadeli in a Knesset Education Committee meeting on Monday. Michaeli interrupted Majadeli while he was speaking and the Labour MK told her to shut up. Michaeli responded that she was just surprised by his disrespectful way of speaking and he repeated that she should shut up. At that point, Michaeli picked up a cup of water from the committee's table, poured it on Majadeli's head and walked out of the room. Knesset Speaker Reuven Rivlin said Michaeli's behavior not only hurt one MK, but the entire Knesset. American billionaire Sheldon Adelson has given $5 million to an independent group backing Newt Gingrich's presidential bid. Adelson, the founder and majority owner of Las Vegas-based company that owns Sands Casino Resort Bethlehem, made the contribution Friday to winning Our Future, a pro-Gingrich super PAC. Adelson is a longtime supporter of GOP candidates and has been a friend and backer of former House Speaker Gingrich for many years. Gingrich's campaign has struggled since a super PAC supporting Mitt Romney spent $3 million on ads attacking him in Iowa.